Hey folks, hope you're doing well. Um, I wanted to speak today about positivity. Positivity. Um, I think it can be quite hard, and I think at times it can be really, really hard depending on how you're feeling. I like to think that I'm quite a positive person, and I think I've always been very positive about my illness. Um, and I like to think, maybe it's different from the outside looking in, but um, I'd like to think that that I've got quite a positive outlook on it all and um, and I think that makes a massive difference in, in your general well-being. I think it makes you feel a lot better about things. I think um, it really helps, I think it just really helps in general with everyday things um, to feel better about it all. And um, I was wondering about positivity, if it's possible to help someone who's normally negative become positive. Um, you see a lot of posts, I'm sure everybody does on Facebook, on Instagram, on YouTube, if, you, if you're if actually looking for, for MSs and what they're going through, then you'll see some people who look very strong and very positive about it all, and you see some people who are almost falling apart and um, finding everything very difficult. And I'd love to be able to um, kind of talk them into being positive about it and explain to them how how to be positive about it all. And I think it would be fantastic to be able to pass that on as a gift to someone. You know, here is my positivity, you have it, and just feel better about everything. I think it would be fantastic to do that. I think we could all cope a lot better in certain situations if we could do that. Um, I have good days and bad days, and on the bad days, it is more difficult to be positive, but I think I have maybe a smaller peaks and troughs, smaller highs and lows. So I think for me when I'm on a low day, it's easier for me to see through the fog and it's easier for me to see that um, that there'll soon be a good day. And I think some people have much lower lows and for them, you know, it's harder to see the, the light at the end of the tunnel and, and see the fact that they are gonna feel better soon or hopefully they'll feel better soon. Um, so obviously that must make them feel more negative about things, but with positivity, I think it'd be brilliant to just pass it on to people and say, right, there you go, you're looking a little bit down, have some positivity, feel better about things. Um, but I, I generally, that's how I feel. When I do have bad days, I do tend to think about the good days, you know, have, have a goal, something to aim for, and, and just think, you know, today I'm not feeling so good, but tomorrow, generally, I will feel a little bit better. If I'm um, having a reaction from my medication, then I'll be on what I call a jab day, and that's when I feel a little bit down. I'm gonna. I feel a little bit suppressed. Um, I can have flu-like symptoms. I can just generally not feel well. And also, I have um, kind of MS flare-ups kicking at that point. Then it's not MS flare-ups. Um, it's due to the medication. But I will have so legs. I'll have pain. I'll have um, poor vision. I'll have cough fog. You know, whatever it wants to be that day. But at that point. I can feel confident that the next day I'm going to feel better and um, for me I think that makes it very easy for me to feel positive about things. I can just think to myself I'll feel better tomorrow, I'm going to have a better day tomorrow or I can't do this today but I can do it tomorrow so I'll leave that till tomorrow and um, that just makes the day an easier day. Um, for some people I think they maybe think about things differently. I think when they're on a good day that they're worrying, worrying about the next bad day. You know if I was on a non-jab day and, and I'm going to have a, a, a jab tonight and then tomorrow's going to be a jab day. I think some people would be thinking about tomorrow, oh I'm dreading tomorrow, what's it going to be like, I'm going to get up, my legs aren't going to be working properly, I'm going to you know, struggle with it, with speech or memory and um, I think some people will be thinking about the bad day on a good day and that's what you need to flip around, really really is. I think if you're um, in a good place thinking about a bad place then then you need to try and turn that around. You need to just stop thinking about those things. You need to get on a bad day and start thinking about a good day. You need to start thinking about things that you're gonna do when you feel good, not about things you can't do when you feel bad. You need to try and find a way to flip this around. And I think you need to kind of just drum it into yourself. You've got to drum it into yourself so that you just start to do it instinctively. And I think then you're gonna start feeling happier. We all have good days, we all have bad days. Um, and it's up to you to decide what you want to think about. Do you want to think about a bad day or do you want to think about a good day? So um, if I can give you my positivity, 
there it is everybody have some and um, just start thinking differently if you find that you feel negative all the time if you find that you feel down all the time just start thinking of the good days start thinking what you're going to do on the good days and um, and when a good day comes make sure you go out and do it and when you're on a bad day just just remember there is always going to be good days so think of the good days forget about the bad days and crack on MS is here for life so blimey get out and enjoy it there's no point dwelling on the fact so anyway that's me rambling on now um, please like and subscribe I should say this at the beginning because no one ever gets to the end please like and subscribe give me a big fat thumbs up um, I love it when people comment I love speaking to people so please leave me a comment below um, and then we can we can talk about it thanks folks take care see you on the next one bye